a conditioner which farts around with the ammonia and nitrite and nitrate, say it binds it or it locks it up, it removes it, or at least it claims to do those things, it will have binding agents in, it'll hold that food back and it might say it releases it after 24 or 48 hours in a different form. That just simply isn't the case. It locks it away. It puts the bacteria on a starvation diet. So the population of bacteria might be, I don't know, 20, 40, 60, 80% down on what it should be if all that food was available for it. Therefore, you never get a full cycle. You've always got high nitrate because there's nothing there processing it, you know. It's a difficult thing to explain because so many people have their favorite conditioners and one of the ones that's a main culprit is probably one of the most popular ones <laughs> in the world unfortunately i call it a trojan horse treatment because it looks nice it promises all sorts and you wheel it in and it causes problems so you end up using two or three different treatments to treat the side effects of that first treatment it's a very a very Mm, I don't know how to say this without offending people that might have participated in a medical experiment in the last few years, but that business model is a very pharmaceutical way of doing things. Mm, shall I use the words? Um, yeah, safe and effective. Look where that gets us. Just go for something normal that'll make the water safe for life. Something that promises too much generally does have side effects which will need to be treated with another treatment. So for instance, the crazy things I often see on YouTube is people doing weekly 80% water changes to keep the water perfect. My water's perfect. I've got the best water in the world. I'm using this, this, this and this. I can feed the fish as much as I want. But I'm changing 80% of the water. If you've got to do that to keep the water good, and keep the fish alive then the filter is not working properly if the filter was working properly you would get away with doing as much of a water change as it would take to go in with a gravel cleaner and just quickly hoover up which might be 10 percent 15 percent a week and your water would still be perfect so massive water changes weekly or even bi-weekly like twice a week indicates the filter is not working about that anymore because I know a lot of people do get paid to say otherwise and their channels are much bigger than mine I don't want you guys to go and start you know spreading the word with them they don't want to know they're being paid to say what they say you know and the fan base fan base I don't like to think that I've got fans but their viewer base and interaction between you know themselves and the the viewers is much greater than mine so it becomes a popularity contest I'm not a popular guy probably because of what I've just said in the last four or five minutes but the truth is the truth